Is she candles in the air? Oh no, the candle went out. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, okay, Aries, let's get started. <sighs> Sorry, I lit out your candle. I got very excited. You know when wax, you know, too much wax gets on, on the candle and it just doesn't burn right. That's what happened. So let's get it. Started. <laughs> I was going to say a C word. <laughs> um, happy Halloween. This is Link. You know, I'm happy to be talking. I usually don't talk. I, I usually don't talk. Um, you know, I don't know why. I just go, but not today. Today I got an opinion. So let's do this, Aries. So Aries, we're going to be using the Orishos. The Orishas. Deck that which made me and deviant design. I think this is Decil Designs. Etsy. No, no. Am Amazon. Etsy. Etsy. I have to block myself from Etsy because I, I I really do spend too much money at Etsy. I also have citrine around my neck. I got it at Afro Punk. If you want to know, I'm sure I can find that business card somewhere. I mean, I am an Aquarius. I'm very disorganized, so. You might be in heavy communication with a water sign, someone with water in their chart. You are very emotionally satisfied and you are fed, Aries. You getting fed. Someone is feeding you. You know, when you're in a relationship, that's when you get the, the relationship weight. <laughs> relationship pounds, as they call it. Okay. All right. I put that card back because no. Okay, Sagittarius got away with that extra card. Not y'all. Not you, Aries. Not the god of war. Oops, I'm reading from the wrong deck. Oh, jeez, I'm so distracted. I meant to read from this deck. My apologies. My apologies. I was like, shut up. Stop saying we wish you would stop talking, just like in the game. But when you don't talk for 19 games, you have a lot to say, Aries. Aries, your major arcana is the high priestess. There might be a Virgo in your life that you just love. If not, <laughs> if not, Aries, um, I feel like this month, you're really being the better person. You're really being a better, bigger person. You're taking on this Virgo energy. It's very stable energy. It's very mature energy. And I mean, it makes sense because it seems as though you're getting fed with the three of earth. These giraffes is getting fed. They are eating. So I feel like you're really eating this month of November. Jupiter is shining on y'all. I'm going to say that this is Jupiter. I know it's really the sun, but let's pretend it's Jupiter. And it's really just making the plants go crazy. He's just eating. He eating, okay? I don't want to hear none of y'all people messing with vegetarians saying, what about the plants, okay? <laughs> let's not do that. But I really feel as though, like, if you apply to a job and if you're worried and you came to my channel for console, I think you're going to get this job. And if you don't get this job, keep looking because I, I feel like, you're going to get a better job, a job that feeds you and possibly helps you feed your family or your friends that might need some assistance. I'm not saying if you have an Aries friend, if you're cross watching, be like, hey, yo, this um, Ashley said you got some money. So you trying to give me some? No, no. OK, no, <laughs> that's not what I'm saying. But I'm saying you're going to be um, very good economically. This month. Um, with the Three of Cups, I feel like you also will be uh, meeting up with some friends. This could be a late Halloween celebration. Maybe y'all are going to a haunted house. Uh, maybe you're just going to a bar because it's getting cold and you need a drink to warm you up. Hey, I'm not judging you. You know, what do you think is in those potions? What do you think is in the green, red, and blue potion, Aries? Just kidding. 
I think. So anyways, with the Page of Wands, I think you should really check your tax deep in November. Especially because I think Mercury is going in retrograde. Mercury is always going into retrograde. Ugh! And then when that happens, communication is bonkers. So just make sure that, you know, be like, did you text me? I have a feeling like if you have a dream that someone texts you, you don't get a text message, make sure that they really didn't text you, Aries. For like important messages, emails will be coming to you. What you've been waiting for is coming. It's so freaking awesome. So you keep wishing upon that star. Sorry. <laughs> With the Nine of Cups, I feel like, Aries, you will be emotionally fulfilled. If you're single, you'll be emotionally fulfilled with being by yourself. You'll be like, well, you know, at least I don't have to deal with that drama. <laughs> I can leave my dishes in the sink if I want to. And I don't have to worry about nobody texting me back or not, standing me up or blah. Um, <laughs> you'll be dating, having a good time, living your best life. Okay, if you're in a relationship, things are going to be more plentiful, happy, wish fulfillment. You're going to feel like you got all the masks, okay? If you're playing Majora's Mask, you're the happy mask salesman. You have all the masks. You just need Majora's, Majora's Mask. But don't worry, you will get Majora's Mask. You will get this mask. Don't worry, you will get this mask, okay? just It's coming. It's it's the build of, of this Emotional satisfaction, Aries. This is about times. So I feel like your reason the past has been a little, you know, garbage. But this is really good. Um, With the four of wands, y'all might be like, I think I want to marry you. Like, like I think I want to marry this person. Uh-uh-uh. If you're in a relationship, things look really good. This glowing orb, of, like, is you picking out rings? Like, engagement rings? I don't know. Let me know, Aries. Um, or maybe you're telling your partner, I really would like a ring like this. And they're like, oh, God. <laughs> um, if you're single, you know, it just means you're chilling. You're enjoying the fruits of your labor. Maybe you've been working really hard. You've been applying to a lot of jobs. You've been working really hard in your job. This could also mean like a promotion, 1%. 4% because it's a 4 raise. You know they don't like to give you double digits. They just want to give you 1, 2, 3% raises. Undines and mermaids. People are going to really help you dream this month. Dream and fantasize about uh, your emotional development. Like you're going to like be with somebody, be on a date with somebody and be like, dang, I can really see us together. Or like hang out with some friends and be like, dang, I can really see us like hanging out, being friends, like, like our lives looking like a sitcom. <laughs> also, um, you might be in contact with a lot of water signs or people with a lot of water signs in their charts. Um, you might also be going on a trip somewhere tropical, somewhere with water. Not every, not every place that's tropical has water, but some place with water. Okay, I'm sorry. You can hit me through the left if you want to. So with the 10 of water, this car got really messed up. <sighs> Anyways. Um, these fish have made it upstream and they're happy. And I feel like you're just going to be really happy in November. You're going, you would have by this point in November slayed all the exes, slayed everybody. You don't care if they were doctors, lawyers, poets that everybody loved. You don't really care who they are. They hurt you. And you realize that that is the root of the problem. And you can't let them keep hurting you no matter who they are or the little things that they do. Like they yell at you and then they bring you flowers. You realize that's just not enough. Or your friends that make you pay for stuff and they don't listen to you. And every time that y'all hang out, they complain about you. And they make you feel bad. And they pour their insecurities out on you. You cut them loose too. And you're in a very happy place. So I feel like this month is going to progress like this. Oh, sorry. So you're going to start in the nine. Oh, 
so excited. I'm so excited. You're going to start in the Nine of Cups or Bottles because Zelda. Zelda! And then you're going to go to the Ten of Water. From Nine to Ten. From Nine to Ten. When you're single and you feeling yourself and whatever, you go on all these dates, people be like, oh, oh can you be my ten? You be like, okay. and they really trying to make you their ten. <laughs> so keep that in mind because that's how I feel. I also see 11. So you might really be attracting that soulmate um, because they're really going to see you as being very, very mature, Aries. Um yeah, so it looks good. It looks very abundant. Uh, congratulations for surviving Venus uh, being in retrograde when that time come in November. Um, happy Halloween, okay? Link doesn't eat candy. He eats robust things. So, yeah.